I'm going with it's a it's warping time and space. Okay. Hey, how are you doing? That was interesting. How could I leave him? I know, I know it makes sense everything he said, but, but it's such stupid fucking self-sacrificing bullshit. Listen, I know Celine, and I know you. I know what you're capable of. He'll make Good, because I don't know what I'm capable of, apparently. Even if all hell stands in your way. I'm so fucking scared, I I know. Oh, I can really use Hank Hill's hel hope, help right now. Not hope. I could definitely use some hope, too, but not from Hank Hill. This time I can continue right after the intermission. Another achievement. Torches. Someone's been here. Hello? Anyone? My hand seems a little stuttery. Hello. I was able to meet them in the park this afternoon after talking to the factory manager at Dinar. A proud moment. Alice has learned to count to three with her blocks. Amazing. She did. And she did, she showed me. There, in the park. What the hell? Nothing in there. Nothing in there either. Rookie mistake. Am 
Am I lost in here? Time to Ooh. shit. Shit, how do I get out of here? Um That's a good question. Here we go. Better not die here on the upside down. I shouldn't call it that, that's copywritten. My bracelet. It's glowing again. It's more of a compass, really. Okay. Points, but no amulet. This is a British explorer. It's also dead. I am defeated. There is no way back. There is nowhere to go. I have searched for a portal, but there is none. I have triangulated the weakest points with Levi's calculations, but I cannot tear a rift, for I do not have a traveler's amulet. I did not need Brennenberg's warnings, or warning, yet what choice did I have? The shadow sensed the orb. I had to risk all and step through the portal. There was no water, and no other means of sustenance. I will not live long. If you, reader, traveler, from whatever world you come, if you comprehend, and if you know enough to speak to those of the human world called Earth, let them know this. I was the first to solve the mysteries of the Gate Builders. I was the first human to breach the boundaries between worlds. I, Professor Thurston Aloysius Herbert of Cambridge, England, was the first. God forgive me. Not like this. There must be a way back. I'm on Tessament. Four days south of Solar. Interesting. Ooh, matches. 
Why don't I take this rope? This could be useful. There are shadows of the dead in the ruins. Those who lived here were human, or near it. So perhaps this was Zerzura, after all, or Eden, or some other stronghold of humanity. But whatever this place once was, it is shattered. There must have been... These must have been the gate builders. But what horror could cause such destruction? Surely even the shadow cannot destroy a whole world. There is no sign of a portal. Even if I were to find one, the orb was lost to the shadow, and I do not have another. There is something else here, stirring in the fog. I see bright lights as it hunts, and hear its cries. I do not think it is alive. Oh lord, is there something here? No portal. Alternative. Rift? Gibberish? Very dark. Ha, I think I found it. Yes. Oh, thank God. This looks promising. I don't like the implication of that hint. You know what? I'm not going to stick around and find out. What happened to them? Oh, Christ. That alive. Right 
Don't like that. Oh, that's a body. <laughs> Hello, stone person. The fuck was that? Sort of bumbling around in the dark here. Just gotta Holy Mother of God. What could do this? Is that the that's the engine. Oh, wrong gravity. <laughs> Whoops, somebody shifted gravity. Alice in Wonderland. By the window, I should get cold. It's not cold. This is normal for Paris. <laughs> All right, I'll get cold. <laughs> Food is ready. Oh, can I see it? It's not finished. Mm. It's terrible. Absolutely terrible. <laughs> Get out of here! <laughs> But remembering causes faces to appear in my mind that aren't real. I was 16, I think. And I must have driven him crazy. But no curfew, no locked doors, just his compass. He said it was so I would always find my way home. I wish I'd known him better. <laughs> So do I. Yet another object without proper collision. Look at that. Hey! <laughs> Am I remembering yet? as I need it to be. I love you, Salim. Put the damn ring on. <laughs> oh, my heart. I will put the damn ring on. And you will wear mine. 